this is the treat. We branched off. Shine, I just waited our chance to blast off. Yeah, all right, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Ken Rodriguez bringing you guys another video of the day. Um, in my last video, I was just talking about some random shit. Pretty much my best friend Greg and Brandon, how I kind of had a really good, somewhat decent friendship with the both of them. Um, I might continue a little bit on to that, and then I'm gonna go into my second guy, which I truly do not like, but you won't even see this video, trust me. Um, his name is Harneet, and um, before I get into him, I will keep talking about Greg and Brandon. Where are they now? <laughs> kind of feels like fucking Oprah when you show when you really think about it. But, um, no, nah, man, uh, definitely, um, everything that I've done throughout the past, it's, it's been a crazy ride. Um, I will say this, Brandon, honestly, guys, if you're out there, dude, hope you're doing too. Like, hopefully you're doing well. You gonna just well. find your seat this time? But the thing nice. is, is that... Are you saving me? Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm making phone calls, yo. Know, you know, I'm a networker. You know me. This is what I do. Hope everything turns out well. But I know him hey, as yo, a Frank. best friend would always know. He, he's, tonight, a, baby. he's a very Woo. chill yeah, kid. Yeah, let's get that so win. I, Look. So I know Brandon. He's not going to be Woo. stupid enough. Hey, get them hunters out. Get them hunters out, boy. I think Brandon, he's at a warehouse. That's what he told me last time. But... Like, last time I really even spoke to him was at Crossgate, so... Yeah, he's a chill guy, man. Um, very, very, very cool. Very mellow. That's for Greg, dude. Dude, that dude was so spoiled, dude. But, uh, how about I just stop, um, talking about him, because it's just, like, the same shit. Or actually, you know what, I could bring up one more topic. Alright, so Brandon has a sister, right? Her name's Jenna. Very, very cute at one point, but then at the same time, she, she didn't really catch my own attention, because I actually grew up with, with him and her, when I was, you know, first starting to develop a friendship with Brandon, and dude, let me tell you a crazy story that she did to me and Brandon at one point, or no, me, Brandon, and Greg, and Jacob, no, 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 me, Brandon, and Jacob, yeah, me, Brandon, and Jacob, alright, so, Jenna, right, she, like, she pretty much smokes weed a lot, <laughs> Yes, I know. She smokes a lot of bud. But the thing is, is that she would always um, chat a full prank on Brandon. So the thing was is that Brandon, right? Um, he told her, "Oh, you know what? Like, you better not pull a prank on me. You better not pull a prank on me, or else I'm gonna kick your ass." And then what happened was that. Yeah, man. She, she had like the nerve to take this right, like, right? Yeah, yeah. Which, you know, this isn't your ordinary spray. This is like some skunk shit. So this is what happened. I think we were like making some burgers or some shit. Or, no, no, we were playing video games. And then, Brandon's sister, Jenna. Oh my god. You know, like, like because I didn't really like her that much. But she, she, was, she was nice and, you know, nice and kind at times. But she would kind of do some stupid shit to this day, which I don't really respect her for. But no, she would take that skunk spray, right? And she would spray it all over us. And dude, I was like, what the fuck? Dude, this bitch. I wouldn't even say she's a bitch. Or, yes, no, 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 she is, she is. But, um, this bitch, she took the skunk spray, right? Dude, she freaking sprayed it all over us. And dude, it felt like garbage skunk shit the whole night. And dude, the crazy thing is that this bitch was crazy. She didn't really give two shits worth about how she felt or how we felt. And it just felt funny as fuck because Brandon, she literally just tried to find her the whole night to, to just kick her ass. But she kind of like just ran away from him. But nah, she, she, she's funny, she me as well. Um, <clears throat> I pretty much would say that Jenna, she, she really like, had that temper mentality, where it's like, if you say anything about her, she's just not gonna listen to you. Or, you know, like, even if you tell her what to do, like, she doesn't give a shit, bro. Like, you know, she, she's by far, like, a nice person, and she knows she is, but sometimes she can be a complete asshole. But, you know what, I can't really say that because I've never done anything wrong to her. 
But nah, she, she was she was she was a prankster, man. She she would go hard on that shit. And the re the weird thing about it is that Jenna, she would try to act so black. She'd be like, I don't like him. Like, yo, girl, like you white, like you're fucking white. But here's the crazy thing. I think Brandon told me at one point he has black in, in him. Which I'm not too sure about that, but at the same time, you know, um, I would believe him because he, he told me that his hair, some of his hairline, um, like, kind of, you know, uh, some of his hairline relates to being black, but that's kind of really true because it's like, well, actually, no, 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 like, it actually is because if you have some black, black jeans, some, some of your hair can be trained like that, but, but, but that's not always true too. Because it's like, that's like, uh, that could happen with anybody. But, um, <clears throat> moving on, um, Jenna, she would always just do the weirdest shit ever. And I will never forget this shit. Alright, so me and Brandon and Jenna, um, I think this is like the time when I was hanging out with them. Um, they wanted.